A big welcome to Rokan Sports and today there is a big question running into the town and the city and none other than that of Jadon Sancho signing up for Manchester United or Manchester United unfailing Jordan Sancho today at Carrington Ground or at Old Trafford to show those to show the fans of Manchester United the shirt number seven. He is the long awaited signing and it's the biggest signing of Manchester United ever since it has existed in terms of money. As in, in terms of money, you might think that it's Cristiano Ronaldo being, I think, the first Manchester United player to win a Ballon d'Or and the Footballer of the Awards in 2008 and 2009, respectively. So, but Jordan Sancho is the biggest signing for Manchester United ever, according to the amount of money that they're going to spend on him. And the big question is, is the English international who plays for Dortmund showing up today at Carrington Old Trafford to be unveiled by Solskja and Ed Woodward? That's the big question. And when is he going to be unveiled at Manchester United? And you see there, posters have already started meeting with other players that Sancho is the long-awaited signee of Manchester United. But let's go factual. Not, we are not here to lie. We are not here to tell you lies. But it's like... It's not yet the time for Manchester United to unveil Jordan Sancho, but almost 90% of the paperwork is done. And only, 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 only one clause is delaying this deal to come to happening. And it's the initial deposit of Manchester United to Borussia Dortmund on the agreed amount of money that they want. The amount of money has been agreed. United wants to give wants to give wants to give Borussia Dortmund an initial deposit of 70 pounds 70 million pounds and Borussia Dortmund Borussia Dortmund wants 80 million pounds for starters and the late and the remaining add-ons will be sorry and the remaining add-ons will be paid in the next three years according to how the contract will have illustrated but very many people expected today Manchester United to unveil Jordan Sancho having unveiled Aaron Wan Bissaka on the 29th and they gave him 29 as his shirt number Harry Maguire was unveiled on 5th was it 5th August yes and he was unveiled and given shirt number five and united expected all united fans and all over the world expected all expect jordan sancho to be unveiled today given shirt number seven because today is the 7th of august and that's why many people are anticipating that the deal is happening today and he is going to be unveiled the big lad there who has 17 assists and 17 goals to his name season 19 or see the season of 2019 2020 is doing wonders and is one of the most valuable teenagers in the world as we speak right about now or in world football so we don't we cannot cancel out anything that is happening but we are more eager that or more expectant that the deal is not happening today but we are not it's not happening today like 80 percent by the 20 percent it might happen because you never know united can agree something in and sancho boards the plane flight from germany to england let's see how long does it take time luck germany to England yes yes so it's not so it's not a lot of time for a plane or especially because 
for these cases, whenever players are going to sign, most of them are given private jets. Sorry. So, we cannot cancel out the chance of Jordan Sancho joining Manchester United today, but we are more expectant that the deal is somehow immature and we expect it to mature in the next one or two weeks when United unveil him. So, Dortmund feel they are in a win-win situation with the Jordan Sancho deal. If they get the 120 million asking price, it's a good deal. If Manchester United don't meet the evaluation or fail to make the deadline, that is 10th August, then they are happy to keep Sancho for next season too. So, for for the likes of um, for the likes of uh, Dortmund, it looks like for them they are in their relaxing ports, looking what Manchester United will do, and they are not having any problem with this deal because if at all United takes the player, they are getting the money. If they don't take the player, they stay with Jordan Sancho. This is very similar to when they were selling Osman Dembele to Barcelona. So that's what Sky Sports is saying that this was the same situation Dortmund put Barcelona in when they are selling them Osman Dembele. And this is an indicator that, like it or not, Sancho is a player for Manchester United next season or next season that is starting on the 12th of September. Expect him to put on jersey number five. The contract is for five years. He is earning £340,000 a week. That's a great. So we expect Jordan Sancho to be at Manchester United next season. But Dortmund is playing all its gimmicks. It's like a rat and cut game, but you know. Even if it's a rat and cut game at the end of it all, the cat gets the rat and the rat gets eaten. You get? So, you have no reason to doubt that this deal is not happening. It can happen anytime. It's going to happen. It can happen anytime. That's what I'm assuring you guys. It's going to happen. Trust me. Manchester United. Although Sosha came out and said that we are looking into all transfers, not going to speak about individuals who are not our players. Sosha has been saying all this, even if it was Bruno Fernandes, Harry Maguire, Aaron Wan Bissaka, the likes of Daniel James. He did not give a positive, a positive take to these players. But at the end of it all, these players ended up playing at Manchester United. So trust me a neutral agent is doing the work between the clubs that is manchester united and busha dortmund so united can say we don't talk we don't negotiate we don't have any agreements but the fact is these people are saying all that but at the back of our mind you know that united is in talks with busha dortmund to kill off this deal of jordan sancho as soon as possible so we might see sancho it's not even a might but sancho is playing at manchester united this season we don't know the, re the, the date they are revealing him, but what we are sure of is Jordan Sancho is going to be a Manchester United player, but we cannot specify or be specific on the date they are unveiling him at Old Trafford and give the fans that, 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 that glimpse or gaze at him and the big anticipations. Because trust me, when this blood comes in, fans are going to be having title hopes and anticipations that we have the player we've been missing on the right attacking flank of the midfield so what makes jordan sancho special there is another attribute that makes jordan sancho special so we bring you the mostly goals for under 23 footballers in 19 in the season of 2019 and 2020 clear Mbappe scored 18 goals marcus rashford scored 17 Jordan Sancho scored 17. So, Marcus and his teammate, that is from England, but we know he's going to be his teammate at Manchester United, make the top, the top, the top two. So, trust me or not, Sancho is the player that United needs and they've made him their priority this season. And trust me, he's going to be at Manchester United and he's going to sign for the Red Devils. Expect him to put him on shirt number seven. As United goes back into the Champions League, expect the brilliancy. They'll be tussling it out or fighting for that position with the likes of Mason Greenwood. But 
we all know that Jordan Sancho also plays well off the left side of the midfield. So the only self player here is Anton Martial because there's no competitor with his style of play and composure. He's just out of this world. So that's it we have right about now. I'm Rokan. This is Rokan Sports. Subscribe to this channel so as not to miss out on stories that we do upload here on a daily. But what we can assure you is Jordan Sancho is a much senate player, though he has not yet been unveiled, but paperwork is at 90% and that 10% is something simple that Manchester United has been doing when it's sending the likes of of um, of Aaron Wan Bissaka. The deal was 50 million pounds. United was negotiating at 40 for six weeks. At after the six weeks United agreed and they unveiled Aaron Wan Bissaka at 50 million pounds. So United always has a problem with that lag of the difference of those 10, 5, 5 million pounds in the deal. Same applied to Harry Maguire, they are offering 70, Leicester wanted 80 million pounds and the, like after one and a half months Harry Maguire was unveiled at Manchester United. Leave alone that, Bruno Fernandes deal was agreed, 65 or 68 million pounds. Initial deposit, United want to give them 30 million pounds and, and uh, Sporting Lisbon wanted 40 something. So. That's United. That's how Edouard does his work. Let's see. What we what I can assure you is Jordan Sancho is a Manchester United player, though he has not yet been unveiled. And I cannot assure you that he's going to be unveiled today or when, or when, or when, or when. But trust me, he can even unveil today, later in the evening, even tomorrow, even next week, or even the beginning of next month. So that's the question we've answered. Is Manchester United unveiling Jordan Sancho today? The question or the answer is in the video. Subscribe. Bye-bye for now.